Hi guys, I hope you are all doing well. Let's see today's question. So today's question, we are taking this up from the topic of vectors. And if I talk about the question which is given to us here from this topic, the question tells us that there are three vectors A, B, C where A is given to us as 3i plus 2j plus k. B is given to us as 2y minus j plus 3k. And C is another vector that is given to us that we have to figure out also with the condition that is A plus B cross product of that with C is equals to two times cross product of A and B plus 24J minus 6K. And the other condition given to us is A minus B plus I cap dot product of that with C cap equals minus 3. And if I talk about the question that is asked to us, it's asking you to find the square of the magnitude of this vector C. And if I talk about the answer choices that we have been given here, the options are 36, 38, 40, 42. So we need to figure out which one of the answer choices is the correct answer for this question that is asked to us here. Let's try to solve this question further and find the correct answer for the question that is given to us. Before starting off with the solution for this question, I would first like to tell you that please do subscribe to my channel and support the channel as well because it takes lots of efforts in making these videos for you on everyday basis. And it is free for you but also motivates me to put up better content and try to make the solutions as easy as possible so you understand them in a better way. Now let's see how to solve this question. So for the vector C which we have to figure out, let's say if I take the vector form as xi plus yj plus zk where x, y, z are the unknowns of i cap, j cap and k cap respectively. So if I have this condition with me which is given to us Vector A plus vector B if I figure out first. So what do we get here is 3i plus 2j plus k. Plus 2y minus j plus 3k. So we get from here 3i plus 2i 5i. 2j minus j which is j. And k plus 3k which is 4. Now the question tells us that you have to find the cross product of this with vector C. I, J, K, 5, 1, 4. And vector C, it has X, Y, and Z. So for I cap, if I do it, I get Z minus 4Y minus J cap. 5Z minus 4X plus K cap. 5y minus x. So we get this. Now the question tells me is equal to 2 times cross product of a and b. So cross product if I find for a and b. i, j, a. Cross product of a and b. a is given 3, 2, 1. b is given 2, minus 1 and 3. So we get i, 6, minus of minus 1. So that's the idea for i j we get 9 minus 2 and for k i get minus 3 minus 4 so get 7i minus 7j minus 7k so we get this now for the cross product now let's put it in the first condition that's given to us we know this is equals to so i into z minus 4y minus j 5z minus 4x plus k 5y minus x is equals to cross product of a and b which is 7i minus 7j minus 7k after that we have plus 24j and minus 6k so plus 24j minus 6k. So we get from here 7i plus 17j 
minus 7 minus 6, which is minus 13. So we get this. Now, if I solve for this, comparing both the sides, I get z minus 4y is equal to 7. Minus 5z plus 4x is equal to 17. 5y minus x is equal to minus 13. So we get these three equations in terms of x, y, and z. Let's solve for that then. I get z is 7 plus 4y. And from here I get x is equals to, if I take x on the other side, gives me 5y plus 30. Now I have x and I have z. Let's put it here in terms of y. So I get minus 5 into 7 plus 4y plus 4 into 5y plus 13 is equals to 7. If I solve for this, I guess minus 35 plus minus 5 into 4, so minus 20y plus 20y plus 13 into 4, which is 52, is equal to 70. So from here, what you are getting is 17 is equal to 17. So you are not getting any value for x, y, z. So you cannot solve this further and get this. So we need one more condition. So for that, I will use the other data that is given to me. So that says dot product of a minus b plus i with c vector is equal to minus 3. So first let's find dot product of or first let's find a minus b and plus i. So a I know from the question 3i plus 2j plus k. Minus b vector if I see 2i minus j plus 3k. plus i. 3i minus 2i, i, i plus i, 2i, 2j minus minus j, so plus j, so 3j, and k minus 3k minus 2. So I get this. Now that tells me the dot product of this with vector c is equal to minus. So 2i plus 3j minus 2k the dot product of that with x i plus y j plus z k is equal to minus 3. So if I solve for this I get 2x 3y minus 2z is equal to minus 3. So 2 x I know in terms of y now 5y plus 13 3y minus 2 Z I know from this 7 plus 4y. So if I solve for this, what do I get? Here is 10y, 13y, and minus 8y. So 5y. 13 into 2, 26, and minus 2 into 7, 14. So 12 minus 3. So 5y becomes minus 12, minus 3, minus 15. Y becomes minus 3. So I get from here y minus 3 and if I solve for that I get x and z. So x in this case I know it is 5y plus 13. So 5 into minus 3 which is minus 15 and plus 13 which is minus 2. And z in this case I know it is 7 plus 4y. So 7 minus 12 which is minus 2. So I have y minus 3, x minus 2, z minus 5. So I get from this vector C, which is xi plus yj plus z. So x, I know here it's minus 2i. y, I know minus 3j. And z, I know it's minus 5. So from here, I get the vector C. And now the question is asking me to find the magnitude of vector C and square it. So if I do that, it's basically square root of the magnitude of this, the whole square. So from here I get square root and square cancel. So I get minus 2 squared 4, minus 3 squared 9, and minus 5 squared 20. So from here you get 34 and 4, which is 30. So if I see the answer choice that matches here with the question given to us, it is option B. So B becomes the correct answer for this question that is given to us here. I hope you have understood how to solve this type of questions which deals with the ideas of finding the solution for the questions on vectors. I'll see you again tomorrow with some other question from some other topic.
and we are going to continue our series of questions on JWE veins. So stay tuned for more videos to roll out. Also, if you're enjoying these videos that we are doing on everyday basis, please do like the videos as well and do subscribe to my channel and share this channel with your friends also who are involved in the preparation of questions on JWE. So they can also take the benefit from these questions which we are solving on everyday basis. Thank you.